everyone, this is Kate from Crocoblog. Today I'd like to go over the brand new feature of JetSmart filters, the hierarchical filter. What it does, well, actually it combines several filters of the same type in a hierarchy to filter custom posts, products, services, items, or anything else that you can even think of. Here now you'll find out how to create and apply such filter to, let's say, a shop page to make your customer's shopping experience easy and enjoyable. Shall we get started? Go to Smart Filters, add new, give a title to your filter and add the labels. Choose select in filter type settings and toggle the is hierarchical mode on. As you can see, now you can add levels of filtering. So let's press on the plus icon to start adding. Type in the label of the first filter, in my case, it's category. Add placeholder and choose the taxonomy product categories. Now let's give the customers an opportunity to filter the products by size. So fill in the label, placeholder, and choose the taxonomy product size. And let's filter the products we offer by color as well. Add the label, placeholder again, and choose the taxonomy product color. Just in case you don't have the options related to products on the list, please make sure that you've added such attributes to your product's post type. So the filter has been created and now we can apply it to our shop page. Follow to WooCommerce, Jetwood Templates and edit the shop template with Elementor. As you can see, I'm using the products grid to pull the products from the dashboard. It allows to customize the quantity of columns and some other useful settings separately for each device, desktop, tablet, and mobile. So let's add a new column for our filter and search for select filter widget. Drag it onto the page and follow to content section. Select the hierarchical filter and apply it for Jetwo Builder products grid. Decide what type of filtering to apply, Ajax or page reload, Choose the way you want it to be applied on value change or on the apply button click and adjust the button tags and toggle filter labels on or off. So now the hierarchical filter is applied to the shop page and I'd like to make sure that the page itself looks nice on all of the devices. To do that, simply click on the responsive mode and choose tablet preview. In general settings, set the quantity of columns to two most of other widget settings are the same for all devices, so pay attention that any changes done here will be applied to all versions from desktop to mobile. As you can see, I just changed the product preset from 1 to 5 and it got applied to all devices. So now click on the responsive mode once again and choose mobile preview. Set the quantity of columns to 1 so the products in the grid are displayed in the most convenient way. I'd advise you to make it bigger, thus more comfortable for your customers. So guys, let's check out the front end and test the hierarchical filter. Let's say I'd like to buy a dress for upcoming birthday party, so I get to choose the dresses category, size, color, I'll go for white, and here we go. I'll speed up the testing a little bit. Anyways, it works pretty nice and I bet your customers would love it. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to give it a like, subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our friendly Facebook community. Cheers guys!